The Shanghai Museum is now holding a special exhibition of 21 ding, or bronze cauldrons, that date back to between 2,000 to 3,500 years ago. Two of the largest were donated in 1951, but were displayed separately in Beijing and Shanghai. The Shanghai Museum has brought them together for this exhibition to display them as a pair. Da Ke Ding, a bronze cauldron from the late Western Zhou Dynasty, is one of the centerpieces of the Shanghai Museum. The cauldron's owner was named Ke, who was King Xiao of Zhou's personal chef. Ke was also in charge of sacrificial ceremonies, etiquette, and publicizing the king's orders. Inside the cauldron, 290 ancient Chinese characters are inscribed in two paragraphs. The first paragraph details the achievements of Ke's grandfather and the admiration for his noble virtues. While the second paragraph documents the rewards, including land, slaves, and clothes granted by the king. Da Yu Ding was named after Yu, a Western Zhou official. 291 characters are inscribed inside the vessel, and it was one of the largest bronze vessels of the Western Zhou dynasty. The inscriptions inside the cauldrons offer important insight into the land grant system, the practices, and officials of the Western Zhou period. There are also another 19 bronze vessels being showcased alongside the two larger ones at this exhibition. Da Ke Ding and Da Yu Ding, along with Mao Gong Ding, are known as the three treasures within four seas. The three large bronze cauldrons were excavated in the late Qing dynasty. A Ding cauldron symbolized authority, power, and status from the Xia dynasty all the way to the Warring States period. Da Ke Ding and Da Yu Ding will be displayed until the mid of July before moving to the National Museum of China. Sun Ziqi, ICS for CGTN, Shanghai.